Hello and welcome back to Retro Rampage. We're here with uh, another classic title. In the year 2013, Super Robot named Mega Man was created. Dr. Wright created Mega Man. He's, he's Dr. That's just poor writing. Yeah, he's Dr. Wright in the... In the stop the evil desires, the sexual desires of <laughs> the, Dr. The, Wiley. The predatory <laughs> desires of Dr. Wiley. Created another eight of his own robots to counter Mega Man. How do you just get a massive weapon and just destroy him? But hey, that's part of the magic. This is an iconic opening scene, though, for a game. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Really, really cool. Now, fun fact about this game is that um, the Rockman development team actually had to work on this in their spare time because Mega Man 1 sold, like, balls. So they were like... They, they wanted to make another one, so they went to Capcom and they are like, Look, man, we want to make another fucking Mega Man game. And they're like, all right, but if you're going to do it, you're going to fucking like, do it at home and Get shit. Get your credit, guys. Yeah. yeah, so they were actually working on other projects while they were making this. Dr. Metal Man. <laughs> yeah, Dr. Metal Man with his little fucking, you know, uh, headpiece. Headpiece, John. Um, there's two difficulties. There's, no, there's, there, it's there's called normal difficult. There's difficult and more difficult. And more difficult. <laughs> um, I'm a little rusty at this. I haven't played in a while, so... I'm, I'm trying to remember the boss order. I always do me uh, Metal Man first, then Wood Man, because he's fucking easy as hell with the Metal Blade. After this boss, we'll have to examine the faces or expressions of the boss uh, avatars on the screen in the free layers. Heat, oh, yeah. Heat Man looks like a complete idiot. <laughs> yeah, Heat Man looks like his mouth is preparing for <laughs> fellatial entry. A special needs guy got stuck in a microwave. <laughs> All the drill dudes. All the drill dudes, here they are. Luckily, vaginas one at a time. <laughs> Luckily, if you if you end up getting murked here, you can farm these things out for some help. They but they're just they can just be complete pieces of shit. The because, popularity is just oh, yeah. no, yeah. The, the the popularity of this game is what brought Mega Man back into you know regular production, not like fucking extra credit on the it developer's spare the time. Started terrible sequel syndrome over at uh, <laughs> Capcom. Uh, yeah, because this is only the second of six that were made for the NES. Um, the first game, like we said, it sold like fucking trash. And it's, it's probably box art as well. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> Mega Man looks like like a fucking straight up like 1980s action hero, but like, you know, on drugs and, and fucking there's like long robots. trees in the background and shit. Not a single bit of that fucking cover artwork makes any bit of sense. And on, and on top of that, people oh, probably up. Look at you. people probably caught wind of how fucking incredibly difficult it was. Like they probably had like one friend that played it and was like, "Dude, fuck that game. game, fuck that game." <laughs> and everyone just like, I took it back to the video store and got Mickey Mouse a piece. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like everyone, everyone told this game to go fuck itself. Well, not this one, but like Mega Man One, and that's why uh, that's why it went to the shitter. On an automotive note, in the background, there's actually uh, crankshafts and pistons and rods moving. There they are. Yeah, the there bottom. they are. There's that the... makes me happy on the inside. <laughs> automotive note? <laughs> oh, look, you got the whole spiel here. Oh, yeah. Dr. Metal Man. Well, once you get this guy's, you know, obviously in a Mega Man game, if you beat the boss, you get their special ability, you get equipped. Dude, his is strong. His uh, kills pr this game is a little broken when it comes to that, because Metal Man can pretty much wipe out everything. I can't believe him using it. Yeah, but I don't really care. It's I, 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 I want to just, like, you know, show you guys the game. But yeah, Metal Man's ability is fucking useful for the entire game. Like, you will always find a place where it's like, you know what? I'm gonna bust out Metal Man's shit. Because he's a fucking, he's just a straight truck. And, and what else is cheap is that his ability... This music's awesome. Yeah, his ability doesn't use that much of, like... The ability gate. Yeah, you can so, just keep so you can you can shit spam out. the Christ out of it. <laughs> All right, here we, we got go. Navy Seal Bubble Man. Mm. Yeah, we got Seal Team Six up Sealing there. Ceiling Fan Man. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm gonna blow you. White Westinghouse up here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dick Man. Quick Man's a pain. Wood man. man looks like a fucking forty dollar version of Manny Faces from He Man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> a chair pet gone wrong. <laughs> Crash Man looks like that fucking terrible anime cartoon with all, like, the Falcon people. What the oh, fuck was that called? I forget. It's from, like, the 80s. Yeah, yeah. It's, it like, very pissed He's the hip young, young robot master. Yeah. Crash Fish Man yeah. looks like Ron Perlman. <laughs> <laughs> Metal uh, Man's dead, obviously. And then Heat <coughs> Man looks like the special needs guy Ooh. stuffed in a toaster. So what's next? You gotta chop up some wood? Yeah, gonna chop up some... 
fucking wood. Woodman's neck. His, oh. his, like, he doesn't even look like a robot. He looks like a fucking very sad, lonely he's man. He's natural, That's, organic man. Yeah, he looks like he's just, like, cosplaying as a fucking tree. All oh, the bats. This whole funny uh, kangaroo thing. Jazz Jackrabbit over here. <laughs> Id Software game. Another great for music DOS. for this level, too. Oh, uh, yeah. This game does have it's excellent music. Um, the slide wasn't introduced in this game. Uh, I think that came in free. But this game still has... I mean, Mega Man has had tight controls for the longest fucking time. Rover. <laughs> Shit. Rover. Mega Man's got a nice butter color. Olive oil. Yeah, I'll take that. It's just, it, See, it the, never the, the metal disc is just unstoppable. I'll tank that. I don't give a shit. Controls in this game bye. are tight, responsive, like any Mega Man. Simple to play and hard as hell to master. Yeah, yeah really I mean, like... Get through it, but I mean, it's, you're, never, you're never fighting the game itself. Like, control-wise, trying to get through that's, anything. That's the thing, like, that you have to understand about Mega Man, is that, like, when you fuck up, it's your fault. And you need to just admit it, you know? You need to deal with it. You know why the metal disc? Bam. You can shoot fucking angular. Oh, I'll take that. You killed all his children, you got a one-up. Killed Donkey Kong. Yeah, look, see? And then I'm, 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 I'm fucking, I'm getting ability shit, like, left and right. It, it, it's a win-win. There, there's no reason not to just play this entire game using Metal Man. <laughs> like, it's just, yep, goodbye. And as you can see, I've spammed, like, 15 shots, and, I, and I've, I've only lost, like, a few... Hey, it makes the dryer sound from DuckTales when you go in the Oh my mirror. god! Dude! That that's, is, that's the that noise. Is, that's the noise For from... anyone who's played DuckTales, whenever you go in those mirrors, it has that dryer buzzer sound, and this is the same sound. That is the same I've sound. I've seen both Capcom games, but I, I, I never, I never knew that. And now here's where the fucking turkeys come into play. The Overdrive Ostriches, the yeah. original versions. Which is a boss from Mega Man X2, which I'm more of a series of the X. I'm a fan of the X series more than the, uh, the regular original. ones. Yeah, but that's for a conversation for a different. That, yeah, that's that's a whole different debate. Right, and now here, comes organic. Now, man. now, yeah, now fucking He's green. Just gonna die. Now green me. man's about to get fisted. Yeah, go green. Go uh -oh. You can just you can just stand right in his duwaza and just light him up. Yeah, goodbye. Yeah, you don't even have to try to avoid his attacks. Yeah, you can just tank him. You can just tank him, light him up with the fucking blade, and he's he's GG. Mega Man just sits there and blinks. Yeah, I'm done here. Well, see ya. <laughs> <laughs> w. Leaf Shield. Yeah, and this game also features the um, obnoxious password screen where you gotta play fucking Battleship with the game cartridge in order to fucking load your game. Oh. Yeah, I don't miss that. Who's next on the shit list? Airman. White Westinghouse is yeah. going down. Fucking oscillating fan up here. <laughs> What's the trick if you hold B and up or something before you start? Yeah, you get the burst. birds in the background. Look at the pissy little devil faces. Ah, uh, yeah, the little fucking the little uh, Tengu demons. This this part's a real real asshole. Yeah, this game could be a hooker. This part. Patience is the key here. Sometimes I don't have patience. For it. Yeah, cause you gotta wait for the little spikies to drop. He got ballsy. Yeah, it's been a while since I played this, but oh God no! He almost Castlevania'd my ass. I was just about to say you're gonna get Castlevania. Oh, fucking Zeus! You're gonna get Belmont. <laughs> I just got Simon done. <laughs> uh, for those of you who may not know, I mean, if you're watching this, you probably get that reference, but. Uh, Castlevania is notorious for enemies like hitting you and knocking you off screen into a pit, which is like it's a really fucking. Oh, that's nah, all right. Okay. It's a really fucking terrible, terrible event because it's like, oh, I'm destroying this game. Yeah, a fucking butterfly sneezes in your general direction and then you fall off a ledge. Goodbye. Yeah, if you let those eggs hit the ground, they're out there. Yep, Never there mind. Is. Yeah, but, but, but you know what? Example. <laughs> but you know what? They're great too because you can totally farm the shit out of them if you need to. Like if you're hurting, blast them with Metal Man. <laughs> oh, the fucking the phallus generators. Yeah. Coxman. And I just farmed full energy fallout from that. <laughs> yeah, that worked out in your favor. The Coxman. Oh, back to these 
these guys. Yeah, back to fucking the Mr. Tango. white hair. No! And you got to right. It was a little mouth. It's all right, yeah. It's all right, yeah. It doesn't, it doesn't start. Right, you gotta, yeah, you got a checkpoint back line. You're not, you're not. I'm even fucking with them. Because. They need you don't to get need the fuck out of my way. They're not in your way. Well, the little phalluses were. Oh, all right. They, they, <laughs> they plopped on down on the screen. Yeah, they flopped down. <laughs> oh god, get up there! Nah, I, 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 that was that's always a close one. No yeah, this you. yeah this one is always a tricky wicket. And then you get fucking birds. Ooh. Oh, cubster. <laughs> I blow hard. Don't worry, he'll have a stroke soon enough. Just let him keep blowing. Oh, yeah, that I... was your the game lagging like that. Yeah, the, these birds will Belmont you this. So you gotta fucking take them out. Kill their children. Murdering bird children. Yeah, I knew you were coming, buddy. Dr. W. Dr. Miley. Alright, now the leaf shield fucks him up pretty pretty hardcore. I'm sure Metal Man would just chop him up too if you had to. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I, I think I don't the, know. the leaf shield just levels him though, right? Yeah, it does, but the trick is getting past get the, the fucking wind the fucking wind tunnels. Nah, that's alright. Oh, yeah, 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 goodbye. That's ridiculous. Two hits. Good fucking night, sweet prince. Next time you have a problem with a box fan, get out some leaves. <laughs> yeah, hurl some fucking leaves at it. <laughs> That'll clog it up pretty quick. <laughs> I guess it clogs his fan up. And I, I don't know. Overheats, I, like burns the, the windings like, out. Yeah, like they tried to be logical with like the boss weaknesses. Air shooter, air biscuit. <laughs> yeah, the air biscuit. Ah, I got one of the uh, <coughs> super weapons. I think this is item two, and that's the platform you need to merc hate man stage. Yeah, yeah. Is it or is, it, is this there's three item, that you need? Yeah, item two is the one that is the horizontal platform. Item three is the fucking thing that crawls up walls. Oh, item yeah. one is the propeller that you pretty much only need for the Wily levels, which is why you get it right before you go there. Yeah. Alright, now, even though I have Airman's ability, which which mercs the shit out of Crash Man, we're gonna, we're gonna slaughter Bubble Man right in his teeth. Uh, this level's pretty annoying, cause, but it, it Cause the matter. metal blade fucks him up so bad. Because... Because Metal Man's Navy fucking attack is just incredible. In fact, I'm gonna use it for probably the, entire the entirety level. of this level. Cause like, cause like, these little frogs, you can't hit them with your normal boss. Yeah, that's it's right, not, you have to wait till they hop. Yup, it's not high enough. Once so again, no fucking, reason not to use Metal Man. No reason. And you just keep getting, uh, the you just, weapon, Yeah, you'll, the you'll keep getting the ammo, so you're fucking set. Goodbye, you little drop block. <laughs> oh, the snail trail. The hermit crabs. That get oh, fucking look, look, dude. Just take everything. Decimate. Decimate. Mega Man Classic on up soon. The jumping in water with spikes around you. Oh uh, yeah. This is yeah. This is a, a staple of of Mega Man platforming. There they are. Shrimps. You gotta. I think there's a big. Yep. Oh uh, no, these are a classic. A lot of games make fun of this. Uh, I was just playing, uh, what's that game with a Bobo in it, that new game, that, that's a, it's a Flash game on Newgrounds, it's like a Bobo's oh, Adventure. a Bobo's Big Adventure? Yeah, I was yeah. just playing the other day, and that, that one of the bosses is that exact fish man right there. Son of a bitch. Shrimp and all. Now the fucking Metroids. Yeah, the Metroids. You gotta be careful in this area, because if you, like, try and drop down a platform too quick, you can fucking clip a spike. Yeah, because you float too much. Yeah, like, you actually, you have to stop. Take your goddamn time. Ooh. Mm. Fucking dryer. Oh, that's another one up, man. That's good because I did. They I did are get, serving you for up, man. I did. I did get fucked, man, in, uh, in Airman's level with that one. That one area where I got. Ah, you died. Yeah, I got uh four lives. That's, that's not too bad. Fucking frog. Get at it, yeah. There's like 17 fucking health checkups. Oh my god! <laughs> you little fuck. Um. The, uh, crab, crab patties. 
and not even at you. You just gotta wait for these guys. Because yeah. otherwise they'll fuck you. Yeah, we're, uh, we're already over to Bubble Man. We're over at the, uh, Navy Who is still. a completely fucking incompetent robot master. He is pathetic. Oh, I'm underwater. Ah. Spikes at the top. Yeah, it's great, pal. He's doing the doggy paddle as he gets it right in the Yeah, but right in the, right in the grundle. <laughs> yeah, chopped. <laughs> Metal blade right to the flesh bridge. <laughs> Uh, and now, now that he's drowned in his own sorrow, he's <coughs> off to I uh, Crash Man next. Um, Quick Man, Bisquick Man, <laughs> Bisquick. I'm trying to remember who the Bubble Lead destroys. I know it fucks up Heat Man, obviously. Oh well, yeah, because that only makes sense. But I think, um, yeah, Flash Man. I think Flash Man. Yeah, Flash Bob Man gets, gets. Yeah, <laughs> the Pearl Stir. He has the defining chin and all. Yep. That's not even like a defined chin. Like Ron Perlman looks like the fucking kid from Mask. <laughs> Again, I'm busting out Metal Man's ability because if I remember correctly, there's little like turret guys. Yep, there they are. Little They're little toy guns. Yeah. yeah. Shit, right. Now I don't have Crash Man's ability, so I can't blast through those walls. So I have to choose my uh, hands very carefully. Like, there are some guys in this level that are quite a threat, like the big oh, the, robot guys and shit. But you know Proto what? Man the, and, um, yeah, the big... Oh, these the assholes, the, the, the wood shield actually fucks them up. Also, the floor is slippery in this Yeah, the floor, so yeah, the floor is slippery, which you gotta is watch fucking metal. obnoxious. Inertia. That guy's just there by himself shooting at nothing. Someday it'll be my turn. <laughs> I think there's... Yep, tops. <laughs> the lazy ass can. Uh, pole. Can. Huh? You guys all right? Here's the part that sucks. Oh Christ! These guys wreck too. They they do some I massive took, damage. I took the wrong fucking path. You piece of shit. Dicey. Oh, these guys! These guys respawn very quickly. Yes, they too. do. So if you back up one step, there's another one. Oh. Yeah, they deal fucking incredible damage for for what they are. Better get that top pass. Oh, look, there's his chance. He missed yeah. it. He missed a chance to wipe you out. <laughs> oh Christ. Yeah, I'm good. Cause you just gotta hold left. We gotta go down this. Yes. Path. This is the relatively safe path, but yeah, it's some the tricky problem platform. is with slide mechanics as well. You're slipping in. You know, no, it's alright. I have to go this yeah. way because there's a cra there's a there's a crash oh. a crash point up there past the energy tank. Oh god damn it! Get murked. Oh, I was oh my god, there's another one. That's what I said, the respawn in these suckers. Right. Just get in the door, just get in the door, get in the door, get in the door. You gotta, you gotta light jump that. So I know, you but you, careful. you slid over, I thought you were I know, going off the ledge, and you have to go it's, all the way back it's, around. It's a rough one. Fight 19 more mech warriors. And now Bubble Man fucks this asshole up, but I gotta watch myself. So he's man on me. You can, at least you're, at least you're... Uh, damn it! It's alright, I'm right there, I have the lives. I don't have to deal with the fucking, with the fucking, uh, you know, jumping assholes. Jumping Jack Flash. Max. I can Actually, just, I can shit just, out. yeah, I can just fucking spam bubbles like fucking Curtis and Gil over here. <laughs> Look at that raw power, those bubbles. <laughs> yeah, goodbye. So yeah, see? if uh, Ron Perlman invades your house, get out some bubble bag. <laughs> yeah, get out, be a, safe. get out one of those, uh, you know, yellow, purple, and neon green bubble guns and just oh, start blasting about away. Things. F. <laughs> get fucked with. The F. <laughs> get effed with Time Stopper. No, uh, I think it's it. Oh, that's Quick Man stage. That's the one with the fucking OMG lasers. <laughs> Yeah, everyone remembers. Anyone that's played Batman remembers that level. Yeah, yeah, that level's no fucking joke. Um, 
But... Thanks, Santa Claus. <laughs> Thanks for item three. Ooh, Mega Man's got a fancy shade Thanks, of uh, old guy from Jurassic Park. <laughs> John Hammond. Yeah. Hammond. Uh, now, I could do Quick Man, but Crash Man's weak to the, uh, to the fan blower. His level's a pain in the ass, though. Uh, yeah. It is yeah, cool, it is. though, it has like a nighttime transition, but, yeah, it's but just, it's, 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 it is a pain in the ass. Has just floating the, mooks the blue, everywhere. The blue mooks, yeah. He's going, uh, this is another level where you're gonna be using, you're gonna be using Metal Man quite a bit. I feel like the music in this level. Yeah, it's, it's kinda fun. It's like it's, it's fun. like it's like goofy music, but it's like when it's like music to fail at a platformer with a running gun platformer. Give it to me. There's some, we've got some color issues. We might be having some technical difficulties here. No, no, I'm on the TV. See the blue blue ass area? Yeah, luckily it's not translating over to the uh the actual capture, which is good. As the screen just goes blank. Yeah, so that's the end of episode, uh... <laughs> <laughs> well, that's the end of Mega Man. We'll put a, uh... Put a quick stop to that. <laughs> now, like, this part's kind of cool. Like, the, the automatically scrolling platform. But it can be they pretty They had just a Mega Man 1 with the minecarts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This Guts part... Man. <laughs> Guts, Guts Man. Guts <laughs> Man. Nuts Man. Yeah, this is where it gets, uh... Gets pretty obnoxious. What cartoon was Gut Guts Man in? It's like a cartoon. It wasn't know. one of the Captain End episodes or something, was it? I really hope not, because he was probably fucking horrible. Oh, Mega yeah. Man, now there's like this. <laughs> well, I think there was a Mega Man cartoon, wasn't there, for a little while? And I that, think that was all the original bosses in it. It was all like Cut Man and Gut Man and all that shit. Yeah, I think there was a Mega Man cartoon that was actually like, you know, probably like enjoyable for, for someone. Not like Captain End, where it was like... Should I, like, gouge my eyes out, or slash my own throat first? <laughs> yeah. Awful. We, we just watched the episode of that, what, a, like a few months ago, and boy, it's even worse than I remember. Oh god, it's terrible. Oh, the classic Mega Man helmet. Alright. God, watch out. Yeah, Pick up your pellet. Yeah. Uh, Which it's, path is it's, it? the, it's the right ladder, because if you go left, it takes you nowhere. You get derped. Yeah, I mean, you can actually, like... I think it takes it to like a one up and it's like some shit if you take that side. Oh god. These this is where the metal metal blade. These can in. ruin you! Because you can just drop to your death. Hey, you can't shoot the buster on the ladder, can you? You can, but it only goes left or right. Yeah, you can't do it that. Oh, oh good man, night. that was nice. That was necessary, because otherwise <laughs> I would have dropped. Necessary. Oh there he is. That's my chance. Yeah. I can be productive again! My cousin over in Flashman Station <laughs> saw you. Yeah, but now he's taking a dirt nap. Now, now. see, you can get that energy tank, That's not but then you have to go all the way down the ladders and all the way back up. And we are way too lazy for this shit. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's the beep. He's jerking his own fucking chain, that guy. <laughs> I like to yank the chain. Give myself a pull start. Now, the trick with um this motherfucker is he jumps when you shoot. So you gotta jump then shoot, like do like a like a short hop, and you can murk him with like every fucking hair blade. Oh man, massive damage. Yeah, goodbye. Two smacks. Two smacks and he's done. Enjoy this now because every other mega <laughs> game afterwards punishes you for this, uh, <laughs> this. Yeah, I mean I'm I'm doing half decent for not playing in a while. But like Mega Man 1, 3, 4, 5, or 6. They're gonna bend you over and do horrible things to you. No matter how fucking your mother will cry herself to sleep for weeks. <laughs> but I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna call it quits here because his stage sucks balls. His stage sucks balls. And honestly, I wouldn't want to make myself look that pathetic. But as you can see, this game's possibly fine. This game's fantastic. Um, you know, I wiped out six of the eight robot masters relatively quickly. But honestly, they're really only like half the game. The other half is the Wily Stages. And the Wily Stages are fucking brutal. I mean, There's like five parts of it. Of yeah. Each castle, right? Yeah, so it's and like. Each one is like two or three stages in a boss, right? Yeah, yeah, it's. There's. Yeah, it's something like that. I don't know if it's like always like that, but I know that for the most part, like each separate area of Wily's Castle is a pretty significant amount of gameplay. So, you know, you get your abilities, but then it's like, now you gotta learn how to use them. 
Um, this game's fucking fantastic. You can pick it up for anywhere between, like, 12 and 20 bucks, depending on the condition, depending on where you're getting it from. Um, box copies obviously go for a hell of a lot more. They're like 40 to 50 for yeah. a box copy. Yeah, because it's, it, they're, they're pretty hard to find box, but, you know, this is, this is a game that's right in the good, like, mid-price range. It's a great addition. It'll get you plenty of fucking gameplay time out of it. Um, it's probably the most accessible Mega Man game too. Yeah, if, yeah, you're, if you're looking to get into Mega Man, if you're just get getting Mega into Man it's a little more user-friendly series, yeah, it's, but it still has all the good qualities of any of the series except for the first game, which is a little rough. Yeah, yeah, the first one was, was brutal, but this one, it's it, it it is it's accessible. You can kind of you can hop in without not really knowing what you're doing and probably like do half decent. I mean, anyone could Google the friggin' robot order and like. You know, the weaknesses and shit. Just remember, use the Metal Blade. Yes, Metal Blade. Use it for like 90% of the game. It's incredible. But, um, that's gonna be it for this episode. Be sure to come back for, uh, for our next show. Till then, keep it old school. Peace.